So let's create and then do a harvest job. We just go into create job, choose the harvest. So now we can select what field or block we want to be harvested. You can select multiple blocks or just, just one, of, one specifically. We can choose whether we want it to be counted in weight or in uh, box types, which we can we can alter a little bit later. I can show you. Uh, we'll just assign it to ourselves, but this could be assigned to a to a crew member, and that crew member can then be a, a team lead if you've got teams and timesheets. So they will all get this harvest job. Then they get a little bit of a summary here, showing them what field they need to be be working in, how they're going to be measuring the harvest. Uh, let's just plan that. So then as a worker, they will come into Farmable, they will see their jobs to do. We can see here we've got a harvest job to do, so let's start. And this will basically sit on top of the field and we can just add harvest as we go. So we can put our weights in here. Uh, let's just say it's a, a 400 kilo bin. Uh, if we've got teams and timesheets, we can select what team has been harvesting. Give it a quick quality check. Um, then we can either, we can pin a location. If we wanted to put the exact spot at the end of the row that bin was sitting on, we can use our phone camera, take a photo. We can just save it or we can also save and print it. So we now have a printable label that you can print off with a Bluetooth printer stick that on the bin or the barrel uh, so we can just keep keep adding our I didn't save that one so we'll just go put our weight in put our quality check in hit save so you can see there we've we've got a kilogram weight you we can then add another one any additional comments hit save so we're, we're totaling our kilos during the day we can then hit finished then that harvest is, is logged for the day, what team did it, uh, any positions you've put the bins in. The other way to do a harvest job is we can just add harvest. So at the end of the day, if you weren't doing it on the go um, through the field, you can just do it as a total. Uh, so we can might count by weight or by units. We can use this, you know, you can set different, um, it might be hay bales you're counting on a certain block or, um, bins, boxes, trays. So we can say we've got uh, yeah, 12 500 kilo boxes at the end of the day. We can say again what team was responsible for this whole harvest. Um, a quality check, GPS, photo, save and print or just save. So then we can document a harvest that way as well.